Stevie asked the bold and the beautiful revealed that Sheila would be angry when she saw Deacon with Brooke, even though the two of them weren't overly intimate. Sheila's now giving all of her attention to Deacon. She loves Deacon very much and considers him to be her own. But apparently Deacon himself doesn't take Sheila as seriously as she thinks she does because Sheila's a wanted criminal anyways. Recently, Deacon has been paying attention to Brooke's situation. Almost everyone knows about Brooke and Ridge's breakup, and Deacon is no exception. Even Ridge and Taylor are about to get married, so Deacon is very worried about Brooke. Deacon is going to comfort Brooke as she is very depressed state during this time. Deacon tried to pursue Brooke but failed, so he understands how much Brooke has feelings for Deacon. Brooke insisted on only wanting Ridge as her husband and never accepted Deacon. That's why when Brooke witnessed Taylor and Ridge going home, she confirmed that she wouldn't be able to stand it. Apparently, Deacon was merely comforting Brooke and had no other shady intentions. But when Sheila saw Deacon and Brooke's meeting, she was furious. Sheila assumed that Deacon was trying to woo Brooke or that Brooke wanted to seduce Deacon when he had just broken up with Ridge. What will Sheila do? Meanwhile, Stefan's return has made Donna feel very happy and secure. Not only Donna, Brooke and Katie are also excited to see their father again after so many years apart. Donna's had a lot of confiding things with Stefan. Anyway, Donna longs to be near Stefan, but for some reason, they've been apart for a long time. Donna wants Stefan to hear about her and Eric's love story. Seeing Donna's serious attitude and happy expression, Stefan easily realized that Donna loved Eric very much. Donna's probably looking forward to a beautiful fairy tale wedding to take place. And Stefan will be the one to hold her hand and walk into the aisle and give her to Eric. Donna completely trusts Eric, and she's sure to have a very happy life with him, but Stefan didn't seem pleased with Eric at all. Eric is really nice, but Eric is old now while Donna is still young. Eric wouldn't be able to give Donna fresh and intense love, and Donna will sometimes yearn for it. Stefan does not mean to criticize or strongly oppose this love. He thinks Donna will suffer a lot when marrying Eric. Donna needs to think more about future difficulties if she really wants to pursue this love. Will Donna heed Stefan's advice?